Hi, I'm Rylan from Aurora Middle School, and today I will be teaching you hands-on equations. So to start, the red cube is a positive constant, but the green cube is the opposite, otherwise known as a negative. And what else do we have? The blue is x, and as you can expect, the white is the opposite of x. And so our first problem is x plus 10 equals 3x plus 2. So as you can see here, I have the same thing. Yes. So now what I'm going to do first is make opposite, add the opposites. And this is an add, this is the opposite. Yep. Just take those away, and I'll take this away, and I should get 8. And now I want to get rid of this x. So I'm going to add a y to each side and take away the pair of 0 here and here and if this is this, and you divide 8 by 2, that is 4, so x equals 4. Our next problem is negative 10 plus x equals the opposite of 3x plus 2. Here we have it. So my first move, I'm going to isolate x. So I'm going to add positive 10 to each side. And this is a pair of zeros, so they go, bam, out of here. And so now we have 12 here, and since x is isolated, we need to get rid of these opposites of x. So we're going to add three x's to each side, and these are pairs of zero, so one pair of zero, two pairs of zero, three pairs of zero. So 12 divided by 4 is 3, so x equals 3. Hello there. Our next problem is 5 plus x plus the opposite of 3x equals 3x plus the opposite of 2x plus negative 1. So here we have it. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add 1 to each side. So this is a pair of 0 and 5 plus 1 is 6. So bam, out of nowhere comes a 6. And so now we have here is this. We want to get rid of these. So we're going to add 2 to each side. And then that's going to go away. These are going to go away. And this is also a pair of 0, so that goes away too. So 6 divided by 3 is 2. So x equals 2. Uh, oops, I didn't see you there. Um, thank you for watching. By the way, hit the like button. It's like, it looks like this. Bye.